Last year, Zane and I did a proposal for NASA. One of their pitches is to make a 3D printer and recycler combination unit for the ISS. So last year, we assembled and modified yeah, this and just like Yeah, yeah. Uh, so we added some automation systems to reduce astronaut interaction. Yeah. Uh, we did a material selection process yeah, to a compare we'll ABS material and some other ones. <laughs> yeah, you no see problem. some samples right here of test pieces that were printed. These are ISS files that are available on NASA's website. We compared build plate materials as well, tested adhesion. And we selected the Lowell's Bot Taz Mini because it's got these auto probe uh, pads on the corners. You can see in the back there, it's got four metal uh, probes. So it'll probe each corner before every print, detect where the build plate is, and print reliably, uh, more so than other printers. So this year, our project is to work on the recyclability of these materials. This is a commercially available unit from Redditech and essentially it will grind up plastic in the top, spit out your waste material, you can then dump extrude. it in the top and it will extrude out. So the advantage of this unit is that it's got a lot of sensors in there, uh, supplies feedback loops, and gives you low tolerance in your filament so that you can recycle and continue to print without any problems. So the object of this is to um, print uh, well, uh, you use your waste and then turn it into something that you exactly. can actually recycle in space. For long duration space missions, this is essential. And uh, what what materials you're using? So uh, the original material was ABS that they were doing testing on. We found an alternate material, which is PETG, which is a little more reliable, doesn't warp. Um, for UV resistant material, we tested ASA. So that's great for not, de not degrading it with radiation. And where's the process now as far as how far along you are with uh, NASA and the exactly. project? So, so NASA sponsored our project last year. We are continuing that project this year with Tethers Unlimited. Uh, they're a company that is producing a combo unit, printer and recycler for the ISS, scheduled to launch uh, within a year roughly. Outstanding. All right, we'll sure Thank to you. look for it then. All right, <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, Ryan.